in this video we are going to discuss about even and odd component of a signal in the last video we will dis uh, we discussed about uh, even and odd signals so here even signals uh, need to satisfy the condition x of t is equal to x of minus t and odd signals need to satisfy the condition x of t equal to minus x of minus t so this thing we discussed in the last class so here each signal is having its own even component and its hard component the relation for even component and odd component is so here for example if you want to define any signal x of t this x of t can be represented in terms of its even and odd component that means x e of t plus x o of t where x e of t is equal to even component of the signal this is even component of the signal this one is odd component of the signal so any signal we can represent with this even and odd uh, components so now if you want to represent x of minus t just you need to consider minus in between this even and odd components if you subtracted odd components from even component then you are going to get x of minus t these are the relations of any signal with its reflected version of signal with even and odd components for example if you want the equation for x e of t you just add these two you just add these two by adding what you are going to get x of t plus x of minus t is equal to these two are going to uh, cancel whatever you are getting is 2 into x e of t so now if you want x e of t just uh, bring this 2 here so x e of t is equal to x of t plus x of minus t divided by 2 this equation is nothing but even component of any signal for any signal if you want to calculate even component you need to consider like this so now similar to this if you want odd component what we can do so we need to consider subtraction if i consider subtraction of these two so this is equation uh, one you can consider like equation one and this is two so if you subtracted 2 from 1 what you are going to get is x of t minus x of minus t is equal to so if you subtracted so you are getting so minus and here plus minus of minus plus you are going to get so x e of t minus x e of t are going to cancel and x o of t plus x o of t that means minus of minus x o of t will become 2 x o of t so if you want odd component you just bring 2 to this side left side then you are going to get x o of t is equal to x of t minus x of minus t divided by 2 this will be the equation of odd component of any signal so for example if you want to calculate uh, any e odd and even components of unit step signal how it will be you will see now so this topic this topic or uh, this topic is very important like uh, gate like technical exams for uh, gate exam like technical exams so they will ask questions like this what is the even and odd components of unit step signal so here i am considering a problem like this so what is the even and odd components of even and odd components of step unit step signal so we know that unit step signal will be like this this is represented with u of t with all t okay so when t greater than or equal to 0 it will be is equal to 1 when t less than 0 it is equal to 0 if you want to calculate even component of your unit step signal so you need to calculate u e of t i am just representing the even component of unit step signal as u e of t you can consider x e of t also as my unit step is represented with the name u i considered u e of t to calculate the even component so the equation is so i am just replacing x with u u of t plus u of minus t divided by 
2 you know how u of minus t will come so u of minus t is nothing but reflected time reflection that means time reversal so u of minus t is like this u of minus t with the t so this u of minus t if you combine and half then you are going to get so your resultant even even path or even component of your unit step signal so here you can consider u e of t i am considering like half u of t plus u of minus t if i consider like this i am just uh, drawing that sketch so here u of t means i need to consider this signal so plus you need to add another path which path we need to add u of minus t you need to add that means this so now so here the amplitude is halved actually the amplitude is 1 for u of t and u of minus t now whatever amplitude we are having that you need to half so here that one is halved so this is u e of t what is the sketch of even component of unit step signal means this is the sketch this is the dc signal with a voltage 0.5 volts in options they may give like anything they may give um, a diagram or they may give in words like uh, you will get a dc signal with voltage 0.5 volts you can see minus infinity to plus infinity this is extending like a dc signal so you will get like a dc signal with voltage half means 0.5 volts like that they may give in options so whatever it may be so if if they are asking equation for um, even component of unit step signal this will be the equation of uh, even component of unit step signal for example similarly if you want to consider odd component of unit step signal then if you want u o of t so i'm just representing u of t your wish you can represent like x o of t also u of t is equal to to calculate the odd component you need to subtract your reversed version from the normal version and you need to half that means so u of t minus u of minus t divided by 2 i am just writing like 1 by 2 into u of t minus u of minus t so like this i am writing so now you can see i am going to sketch this u o of t so here how we can sketch this so here u of t you need to consider i am considering u of t minus u of minus t minus means so you will get down your signal will get down whatever signal we are having with minus that signal is getting um, negative y axis so that means u of minus t is actually here uh, because of this minus you are getting here and both amplitudes are half this is u of t and this is minus u of minus t so both are having initially 1 1 as amplitude both u of t and u of minus t having amplitude 1 because of this half both amplitudes are halved so like this we are going to get so u o of t so this is, this is the even component of unit step signal this is the odd component of unit step signal the sketches for um, even and odd components of unit step signal will be like this and uh, here the equations will be like this now for example if you added these two what you are going to get you can observe so here this is plus 1 in the negative direction this is minus 1 in the uh, negative y axis so this is plus 1 and this is minus 1 these two are going to cancel right and here we are having half and the here we are having half what we are going to get if we added these two if we added these two what you are going to get is like this only so with amplitude one half plus half you are going to get one this side these two are going to cancel again you are going to get u of t only so that means by adding even and odd components you are going to get your u of t so here for example if you want to get u of minus t then you need to subtract this from this you are subtracting means my one minus minus of minus one this is minus one and this is one one minus of minus one become one plus one so that means here this is not one actually this is half minus of minus half then it will become uh, minus one so here 
you are going to get if you subtracted these two signals then here you are having a half minus of minus half it will become 1 in the amplitude this side and this side if you consider half minus half you are getting 0 here this is u of minus t that means if you add it uh, diagrammatically also if you added even part and odd components you are going to get u of t if you subtracted odd component from even component you are going to get reflected u of t so like this you are, you need to get the equations so in the next class we will discuss uh, some more examples related to this even and odd components so this topic is very very important like anything in gate